Hi everybody, this is Lorenzo from Spot Home Lisbon. I want to present a two bedroom flat in Rua Luz Sorian. We are in the area of Bairro Alto. Living in this area has some good sides and some bad sides. So the good sides is that Bairro Alto is a very old ancient area in the city of Lisbon. So if you want to have a true Portuguese experience, I would really recommend you to come and live in this apartment. The bad sides are that basically there are no supermarkets around. The closest one is about half, uh, half an hour walking away from here. Uh, so, uh, regarding the public transportation, we have uh, Caix do Sodré, which is both train and metro station. It's about 20 minutes, half an hour walking away from here. We have Rocio, which is also both train and metro station. It's about 15-20 minutes walking away from here. And we also have Restauradores, which is a metro station and it's located about 20-25 minutes walking away from here. So, let's have a look. I'm starting from the living room. You can already see a few steps. Uh, this is a two-floor apartment. But here, from this point of view, you can already see a big couch, dining area, and we also have a television. If I step onto the other side, you can see a kitchen, but first let me give you the opposite overview. This is a very nice flat, I have to say. I would also like to show you the neighborhood. So, this is Bairro Alto. You can actually also see the river over there in the distance. Now, if we go back into the house, I would like to show you the kitchen, which is right in front of us. Kitchen is very nice, pretty big, no windows, but still, as you can see, there is a, ro a lot of natural light coming from the living room. We have a fridge, electrical hob, oven, microwave, kettle, coffee machine, dishwasher, washing machine and the kitchen is also fully equipped. So we have some cutlery in here, we have some pots and pans in here, we have some plates and bowls in here, we have some mugs and we have some glasses. Through this door we have uh, the first bathroom, it's not fully equipped as you can see, we have a toilet and a sink, but it's always convenient to have two bathrooms in the house, no worries we have a full bathroom upstairs. So if we go here, we go back to the living room and in here, as you might have already noticed, we have a very nice dining area with a big table for you for have your dinners your breakfasts and so on. This would be the view from the dining room, which I would say it's pretty nice. But now let's go upstairs. So going upstairs through these steps, we have bedroom two, bedroom one and the bathroom over there. So, as I was telling you, this is the full bathroom. As you can see, we have sink, toilet, bidet, and a big shower. Of course, a big mirror in here. Then, if we turn here on the left, we have bedroom number one. Bedroom number one is equipped with a double bed. We have a chest of drawers, an armchair, and a big mirror over there. As you might have noticed, that's a skylight, which means that we are on the last floor of the building. This would be the opposite overview of bedroom one. If we go once again through the door and in front of us we get to bedroom two. Bedroom two is equipped with the two single bed, chest of drawer, uh, coat hanger and we have one and two night tables over there. Same thing as bedroom one, we are on the last floor of the building, so that would be a skylight. And this is basically the opposite side of bedroom two. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed the visit. Take care, bye!